Hey guys, Silent Seo here. Welcome back to another Utah Macross video with me. As you can see from the banner that we have here, it is actually Kaname's birthday right today uh, in Japan. And of course, if you play any live song or any song with Kaname as the center diva, she will gain more EXP than the super normal. And of course, this leads up to her ranking up way faster. So if you are still not familiar with ranking up the divas and all that, um, you can go ahead and look at my previous videos under the Ultra Macross tutorials playlist. Um, I do talk about why it is important to rank up the divas uh, proficiencies and all that. So we're not here today about proficiency talk, we're here about today's Kaname's birthday step up. Gacha! So let's take a look at the Gacha page right now. So if you're not familiar with the step up gacha as you can see here, uh, it is similar to the one that we first had for Ranka's birthday. Um, and yes, in order to do uh, or rather in order to pull the best amount of episode plates available um, for the step up gacha, you have to prepare the amount of singing stones needed. So as you can see in my top right hand corner, I've already prepared more than enough singing stones. I've actually bought a pack. And of course, I've actually saved up about 900 singing stones before then as well. So yeah, so altogether, I have more than enough to pull up to step 4, which is the most important uh, step for the gacha. Um, so we're going to go into the banner itself and we're going to talk about what is um, the most useful Kaname episode plate available. So as you can see, the one they immediately advertise here is the most powerful, and I repeat again, the most powerful Kaname episode plate in the game currently. But do take note, this episode plate is a specialization episode plate. It means that this episode plate only focuses on charm, which is 1807. Uh, it is definitely lower than uh, Reina's wedding episode plate, but it is Kaname's most powerful plate as of yet because the total value is 3418. So, that in mind, alright, it is the most powerful supportive plate that we've currently got because it helps boost here, yeah, score, yeah. So, alright, let's take a look at the episode plate itself. Alright, so active skill, it has an S rank active skill which is fantastic because any skill that is an S rank, it means it is meant to be used in that manner. So for 12 seconds, your combos do not break. So 12 seconds is a very long duration of time. So if you have any challenges or songs that require you to avoid breaking or clear with full combo, you know, this kind of episode plate is necessary um, to help make things a lot easier. And of course, it's life skill, which is also an S rank. At the beginning of the 42 second mark, at 8 seconds, yeah? So it helps improve your accuracy tap. Then for 12 seconds, it helps boost your score by 50%, which is fantastic. Any skill that has a double effect is very, very useful. But sadly to say, you know, as long as the plate is powerful on its own, it most likely will not have any special notes attached to it. So that's kind of sad. So for its center skill, as you can see, it is not fantastic. Uh, it's only of A rank. Um, units charm is increased by 60% up. So this plate, yes, definitely is a high score boosting plate. Whether you want it to be in the center or not, or you want to have you use it as an active skill or not, that's up to you. But this plate generically, it is more about the live skill itself. So fantastic, fantastic stats. And you can see his voice is pretty high, even though um, the charm value is rather high. The, book, the voice is still pretty high compared to other voices, uh, I mean, other plates that we've seen, like we've seen Reina's wedding plate. Um, the voice was around the 600 range because the charm value was beyond 2000. So yes, when there is something of high value, usually the rest will be affected as well. But for Kaname's, it tends to more balance out. Um, so yeah, that's pretty awesome. Alright, the second most important plate you probably want to get from her gacha is this one. Because if you didn't know by now, Kaname is a character, a diva that helps mm, in events in a way. So let's take a look at this plate. Uh, you'll definitely see what I mean later on. 
Alright, so this is one of two Kaname plates that you definitely must have during ticketing events uh, because this her plates usually give out notes, if you take a look here, with items. Yeah, so this is very very important with the current event we're going through right now which is ending in just a few hours. So if you guys haven't uh, gotten enough score to rank yourself up, well if you obtain these plates at the last moment, please make sure you use them in your life to help you boost the amount of points you can get at the end of the life because they help you produce more item notes within the life itself. So let's take a look at the plate. It is generally on the low side in terms of total amount. It is definitely not a center plate because its center skill is of an A value. Um, but do take note, the charm value is very high compared to her previous uh, 6 star episode plate. This is definitely focusing more on charm rather than voice as well. So yeah, and of course the total value is not as high. So definitely, definitely lacking a bit compared to the pink color plate. Alright, the center skill, unit's charm value increases by 60% up, which is exactly the same as the previous plate. Alright, it's active skill, as you can see it's an A value. Incre uh, recovers 30% of your HP when it's activated. And of course, the main focus of the plate itself is a life skill support. Uh, 60 combo mark activation. So you have to activate it. You, you have to go through the 60 combo in order to activate its life skill. So if you tend to break regularly, uh, this, this skill will definitely not activate itself. So you have to get good. <laughs> I'm sorry to say. Uh, but yes, you have to improve your standard of playing in order to have this life skill activated. Uh, if you are playing difficulty levels that you are capable of uh, sustaining full combos, definitely this plate will come into effect. But if you're playing extreme and you're practicing extreme uh, and you do tend to break a lot during extreme, this plate is definitely not going to help you at all. So alright, 60 combo mark. Alright, for 14 seconds, your score will be boosted by 80% up. So definitely, definitely a fantastic plate to have as well. Mainly because of this thing in effect. <laughs> alright. So I don't think there's any other plates they are featuring. So these are the two main plates that you definitely want to try and get from uh, Kaname's birthday step up gacha. So alright, the first step is definitely a discounted gacha. So it's 300 stones for 10 plates pool. Let's do this. We're going to go all the way to step 4. So if you're wondering what are the episode plates available, you can actually view it from here but they're all in Japanese text. But if you really want to see images and all that, uh, you can go on to Uta Macross page, everything is uh, up there. Uh, if not, if you want it uh, well brought to you easily uh, rather than going through uh, the pages of Japanese text, you can actually join us on the Facebook group uh, that I am actually ad uh, administrating. Um, I'll leave the Facebook group link in the description down below so you can join us there and we can talk Macross wherever whenever whatever time zone you are from <laughs> all right guys so first pool for step up one here we go hopefully you get something nice so as usual what we're looking for is the golden orb at the beginning if not five valkyries then hopefully the orb will change to a golden one then if not as many red boxes as possible then hopefully you will see a rainbow box reappear uh, at the second bling or when they were introducing the plates um, your diva comes out and evolves a red color box to a rainbow one. So that's pretty much the standard stuff in Uta Macross Gacha. So let's do this. One, two, three, four, five. No rainbow. Okay, but there is still a chance. You know, three boxes. Hopefully, one will change to a rainbow. So none of them change to a rainbow. Hopefully, the diva pops up and then, of course, changes it to a rainbow. Here we go. No, no evolution. Okay, we've got a Kanami plate, definitely. Alright, definitely gonna be a useful uh, 6 star eventually, uh, no, 5 star eventually, sorry. Let's skip all the common ones, because that's not important. That's a lot of common, oh, Maki, Maki, woo! No evolution, okay, that's fine. We got the, some of the fans prefer the Ara combo. <laughs> oh, there we go, Ray Ray's coming in to help. We got our 6 star plate, oh! Okay, so I've definitely evolved this plate, so it's adding on to a luck panel or a secret board. So definitely something looking forward to. 
you know, uh, having six star plates with luck value, that's definitely wonderful. All right, so definitely I did not get Kaname's main plates, uh, which is kind of sad, but lots of new plates, which is good because uh, I need costume points for certain costumes. So that's always wonderful and always welcoming. All right, so step up two. So step up two, basically we are uh, we are guaranteed a double rarity up uh, for five star plates. So all right, this is definitely um, exhilarating because hopefully we might be able to get two to three six star plates available in this pool. Um, it is considered like the normal big up. Uh, big rate up in the normal gachas when the new gacha comes out but you know it's definitely something you try and anticipate a better luck from rather than pulling uh, a gacha that has just standard rates up so all right let's do this all right so I don't have to blabber on anymore, let's just tap and go. <laughs> oh dear lord, this is not good. Oh boy. Oh, two red boxes, okay. Okay, let's skip all the common stuff. Here we go. No evolution, but that's fine. Oh! Uh, getting a lot of mucky and race. Hmm. This feel more like a Makina pool than Kaname's pool. <laughs> Alright, let's get all the common stuff. Uh, didn't do too well with the step up too. There we go. No evolution, that's fine. Oh, Freya! Okay. Okay, so nothing new, definitely, but uh, always nice to have secret bots uh, added on. You know. Um, I, I can't... I can't... I can't promote having repeated plates more than enough. You know, every time I do gacha pools, I will try and say that don't look at it at the, the downside. You know, you know, in Uta Macross, having repeated episode plates isn't a bad thing. You know, uh, in the long run. All right, so step three uh, is a discounted pool again, but the rate is normal, so it's four hundred stones for ten episode plates. So it's not too bad. So the last pool is definitely step four. I'm not going to go with step 5 because I want to conserve my singing stones for other gachas in the future. So this is a, this will be a normal rate. Hopefully this this pool will be better than the big rate up that we just did. <laughs> 1, 2, 3. 3. Okay, 3 planes. That's fine. Oh, we got a 6 star plate off the bat. Alright, that's fantastic. Okay, let's skip the normal ones. Here we go. Oh yay! Okay, so definitely one of the main plates that uh, we are getting. Uh, I definitely don't think I have a copy of that, so it's a first, a brand new plate probably. Um, yeah, hopefully this one evolves. Nope, okay, no evolution, but oh, nice! Lots of uh, secret bots, I guess. Hey, so the Kaname plate is definitely a new one. Oh, Evolve. Hmm. Okay, not too bad. So, here we go. Alright, you guys can have uh, enjoyment of looking at the plate's full image. Uh, yeah, so there we go. Uh, this is the second plate that I have of Kaname's that has the item note uh, within its... Uh, Arsenal. So that's pretty fantastic. Now I have both Kaname plates that actually provides increase of item notes. Uh, so I'm going to definitely have that equipped later on and uh, boost up my current rankings in the current event. Alright, so step 4. Step 4 is the last one I'll be pulling. Uh, and it's the most beneficial one because step 4 guarantees you a 5 star plate. You know, and there is still a chance that you might get other stuff. So one 5 star plate guaranteed to you. Um, it might evolve the current plate I, I just got, or uh, maybe they will give me the most powerful one, which is right here. So, <laughs> who knows? Anyway guys, let's do this, the last and final gacha pool. Alright. Here we go. One. 
One, one plane, that's it. Oh no, what the heck is going on? Okay, where's my guaranteed plane? There we go. Okay, so hopefully the two red boxes uh, stand a chance to evolve. Let's just skip all the common plates. Here we go. No, no evolution. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we got another secret bot unlocked for this fairy fairy plate. That's pretty awesome. Looking forward to have a uh, plus 25 star plate <laughs> eventually. <laughs> Alright, here we go. No evolution, that's fine. Oh! Okay, we got a plus one luck on this plate now. That's fine. Here we go, the six star plate. Will it evolve my plate? Yes, it evolves! That's fantastic! So I've got one of the better uh, support plates for Kaname. Uh, it is definitely not the most powerful support plate, but it is definitely the most useful one uh, for event use. So definitely, definitely very happy with this pool. Alright, so let's go. I'm going to show you guys the image for that plate. Just so you guys... In case you don't ever have the um, plate yourself, at least you can actually view it here on my YouTube video. Alright, let's take a look at the new plate. Oop, there we go. Oops. Had the wrong thing. Let's go back. Alright, gotta hold. Press the image. There you go. So it's the full image for Kaname's fully evolved 6 star plate um, that gives extra item notes so this plate is definitely a must-have if you're wondering what is the actual uh, the second plate that kaname has that actually boosts items well let me just scroll down or let me just change the tab so you can actually view it much quicker so kaname's this is the plate we are talking about so it is her xr plate which actually has item boost of course the amount is lower because this this is the earlier version of her plate that was released uh, the one that I just got is a more advanced version of this plate. So altogether, definitely you will get 20 item points. So if you're wondering how the uh, point system actually works uh, to obtain a new note with the item note inside, well, it goes by 10. Uh, so it's like 10, 20, 30, 40. Then you, get, uh, you will obtain uh, a new item note within the live itself. So let's say for example, under very hard, normally you will get 46 item notes. If you have like a 20 value of item uh, notes added on, well, you will have like 48 at the end, 49, so on and so forth. If you have as many plates that actually boost item notes itself. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you did uh, better than me in terms of the step up pools. But I am very, very glad that I actually obtained this Kaname episode plate. Uh, Although it's kind of sad that I did not obtain her most powerful support plate. But, you know, eventually when the years pass, um, better plates will surface and, you know, those plates that we currently want right now may become obsolete, which is kind of sad. But, of course, you know, if you're a real fan of Kaname or any fan of any diva, you will want to have all of them <laughs> in your collection. <laughs> thank you guys once again. I can't say thank you enough every video. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like what you see and hear, do hit the subscribe button for more Utah Macross content. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, bye!